Bro, this is literally insane. This is my homie that tattoos me. Like I said, really? I want to get tattooed. Bro, I'll bring him through. Dude, can you do that today? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Oh, I didn't see you there. What is going on, everybody? Jesse James West here. I am in the beautiful state of Miami. No, it's not a state. That's Florida. Anyways, we're meeting up with my boy, Chris Heria. I have been waiting to meet him for a long time. We've been homies for quite some time. I made a video eating and training like him for a day. He responded a year ago, and we've been best friends ever since. So we're going to go meet up with him, say what's good, check out his $4 million small apartment. I mean, it's not that big. It's like average. Let's sit over there and say what's up. It's pouring out. Oh, there's thunder. Okay, that's different. Hey, you guys. Hello. It's raining. Are we going out tonight or what? I mean, tonight we gotta work, man. Oh, you know what? Yeah, we're working on the weekends. Like Drake says. Bro, this is literally insane. This is absolutely goals, living in a place like this. I mean, I actually, I own this place. I bought it for the video. All right. I've never been on this fancy of an elevator. Dude, doesn't this look so fancy? I feel like I'm in Batman. Howdy ho, baby. It's good to finally meet you, man. Yo, for sure. How are you? What's up, bro? This is Joey. Nice to meet Joey. Get yep. man, Joey. Yo, come on, man. Yo, this place is crazy. Yeah, man, make yourselves at home. You guys want something to drink? Water would be great. Chris Heria, the man, the myth, the legend in the flesh. You're one of the first She's people that, when I did like the eat, eating and training, uh, he responded and was like, yo, like, and then we've kind of been boys since, so. I'm fucking well, grinding. And you've been getting tatted. I've been getting slowly, what? slowly. I'll probably be like you eventually, that's my goal. Oh shoot, for real? I want to be covered, man. I'm just like holding back right now. No, Guys, so should, what tattoo should I get? Should I get a neck tattoo? Yeah, you can get one with me, bro. Yo, I got a whole tattoo station in my office, bro. Actually, what's your favorite tattoo? Yo, this one, dude. This is my son. That's sick. This one? Like all this? Yeah, this is like, no, this is just this. Just that? Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. No, this man. isn't part of my son. This is like a, I didn't. I thought your son would be a, dra <laughs> a dragon or something. Right? You know what it's I mean? Like, this is my homie that tattoos me. Like I said, really? if you want to get tattooed, bro, I'll bring him through. Dude, can you do that today? Let me call him. So, we're going to go hit a some sort of session. Maybe you should Sunday do a sauna. Session, a Sunday session. I'm yeah. down for it. I'll just show you what I normally do. Yeah. He says his training's boring, but I feel like it'll be quite interesting. I have a weighted vest. Yeah. We're gonna do some cardio. Yeah. And then work on some technique. Okay. Because I already did everything already. Like, yeah. This week, so. And then, and then I'll like take him for a little, a little, maybe a little arm pump. Oh, too. Just a little bit. Do they have room service? I mean, like they just have like a, a restaurant downstairs, and they oh, bring okay. it down. I guess it's like room so service, really, but it's not. Yeah, like, okay. It's not like a restaurant. Uh, pretty a hotel uh, or anything. Pretty nice. Hey. Dude, Give me whatever. two years. I'll you be your neighbor. Hey bro, Maybe guess, a year. I have a guest room with your name on it right there. Bro. Let's go, baby. Let's go. A little espresso shot for the boys. I used to come to this building back in the day when I was a personal trainer. My ex-business partner used to live here, so that's how I know about oh. this building. This building was yeah. like an inspiration for me too, and this was like kind of like one of those motivations. Like when you uh -huh. just came on my balcony, I was like, yeah. yo, what the? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I even remember feeling like that too, and like looking at both sides and being like, damn, this is crazy. Like that's what opened my mind to like. You like, see it and then you make it happen though. That's the exactly, coolest part. Exactly. Because the person that I was with, you know, you realize like, yo, these people that have things, they're no better or no smarter than me and you. Uh huh. You know what I'm saying? And once you know what they know. Dude, I love yeah. it. That's motivation right there. Man. Okay, ready? I'm going to do, what is it called? Full planch. Planch? Okay. Full planch. Just like I taught you, Jesse. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was talking. All right, guys, we're going to be doing a little bit of cardio, okay? I'm going to bless you. Do I face you or face the other way? Face the other way. Get you. Just like that. Wow, Man. I feel like I just got baptized. It's the Chris yeah, this Harry is the experience, experience yeah. yeah. This is the Chris Harry of Sunday, baby. We work out. We gotta get some good vibes in the sauna, chill. I love play it. Some music, possibly spar. We'll, we'll fight a little bit. Let's do it. I don't. I think you might kill me. No, I'll show you the basics, and we'll just play okay. around. Gotta keep riding the wave, bro. Exactly. That's it. Even this weighted vest. Keep riding the weighted vest. Oh, I love the vest because when you train, it just like mentally strengthens you as well. Because you're thinking normally you would you would keep going, you'd be like, oh, I feel like giving up, but you wear like you wear those excuses on yeah. you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, yo, this shit, I'm not gonna give up even though I got this on me. You know, like all those doubts. That's all the weight in there. Everyone doubting me. That's this weight I'm wearing on my chest. What keeps you motivated? Obviously, my son, my family, stuff like that. But definitely, bro. 
is everyone that's already supporting me, everyone that already believes in me. I can't let those, I can't let those people down. We're gonna be following Chris along with his little, not little, his calisthenic workout that I'm gonna struggle. We're gonna be doing push-ups, pull-ups, hanging leg raises, and then pistol squats. It's like a circuit kind of? Yep, 10. 10, 10, 10, 10. So we 100 reps each. 400 reps. I'm really sweaty. I'm a sweaty guy. That's why we're in Miami, baby. That's why we're in Miami, let's go. figure out how to stay still. What would you say to anyone who's trying to do that? Activate your scapulas, pull uh, like that, and, and squeeze harder okay. on the bar. If you have a loose grip, and you're just like this, every time you bring your, face, your feet down, yep. you're gonna, gonna catch that. You're gonna go back. back. Guys, grip it and rip it, baby. Do you always train sort of like, without circuit? Like, yeah, it's not like non-stop circuit? When I'm training, like, for certain things, yeah. Okay. Like, I'll have my it, days. It varies. Yeah, exactly. But for the most part, when I'm doing my warm-up, which is like stuff like this, back oh, to this back. is the warm-up. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. I'm just not drenched in sweat. Warm up, no rest. Back to back. Low key, like if we were to do some sort of competition yeah. of like athleticism, I feel like you could beat me in athleticism. On, bro. No, because like you have like a different like strength. Endurance. And you have an endurance, I yeah. Think, I think specifically, you know, everything in my opinion is what you train for. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Like if you're training, if we have a competition on handstand push-ups, I'll probably win. Maybe. But if we have Maybe. a squat, if we have a squat competition or whatever you train <laughs> the most, ass. you kick my ass. <laughs> it's everything's what you train for. That's why yeah, yeah. you can never really take like what any anyone's saying to heart. And if anyone is also complimenting you, of course, take that as well. But take you can't really take that with heart. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Because exactly. everything is from anyone else's perspective. Like what's important to you in training may not be important to me or yep. something that I'm even trying to do. If you're judging me for not being able to shoot a three pointer. I don't play basketball, bro. Yeah. All right, my man's on the move. And now a word from our sponsors. Before we go any farther in today's video, I want to thank today's sponsor, and that is SeatGeek, baby. Listen, I know that you're going to go to a concert. I know you want to go to a live event, so why aren't you using my code Jesse to save yourself $20? Well, what is SeatGeek? Oh, I'm glad you asked. SeatGeek is an amazing app that you can literally buy tickets on the go wherever you are, even in the comfort of your home, like I said. You see, SeatGeek rates tickets 0 to 10, green being good and red being bad, making it nice and easy for you guys to buy tickets that you're actually going to want to go to. So once again, I've got the hookup like usual. Use code JESSE on SeatGeek app. My boyfriend is so nice and he's going to get me the best tickets ever to a Mumford & Sons concert. Oh my god, Front yes! Front row and VIP backstage passes. You're so Yeah, sweet. oh. Oh, okay. I guess, yep, that, that has to happen now. Okay, thanks SeatGeek. So we're gonna move our way onto a little bit of arms. He taught me a little calisthenics. I'm gonna teach him a little bodybuilding, even though he probably knows a thing. Let's go, right? let's go. A little, little size up. Going for it. <laughs> What do we do? Toss in here? Yep. Is it bad if it splashes? Yeah. Let's do a nice and slow. Oh sh Welcome to the Chris Harriet experience. Oh sh I'm okay. I didn't know what steam's at you. This is my dog Al, one of my best friends out here. So bad. If you guys have ever heard the song uh, what was it? Let it go. Let it go. Justin Bieber and uh, Khaled just came out. I got me the beat. Put it on, baby. Yeah, yeah, bro. That's amazing. That's just a little Congratulations. Yeah. I mean, we can't talk about all the artists he's worked with, but let's just say he's worked up with like everybody in the industry. Can you make me a famous singer? Yeah. 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 Right. We, we can try. try. We're we'll we'll talking out Yo, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. We'll remake uh, some Panic at the Disco. That's all I could sing. All right. I joined it. We're done with this. Let's go back upstairs. Let's make a little beat for Jesse. Yeah. We'll put on some auto tune. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yo, we'll make a little I love it. Now we shred it, boys. Ready for step two? Oh, yeah. Ready for step two? Step two. We got a steam room. Yep. Is that an old man? Oh, the old man is sitting right there. I'll catch you guys after. <laughs> Holy this. This is where the magic happens. So, where is this the starter office or are you going to go to the elevator? Oh, you're already in my office. In my asshole building. Is it? In my house. 
It's like, where we go? Well, which one's yours? It's like, all of them. All of them. <laughs> okay. All right, y'all. Alright, is it, is it in? Ugh, no, is it in? <laughs> Let there be light! Well, I'm not going to get my hair cut. You get a haircut in your office and get yeah, tattoos in your office. Right there's my tattoo. Tattoo spot. Oh wow, this is okay. This is where I need to work out something. This, this is all about timing, bro. There you go. Yeah, that boy's a natural. Okay. Respect. This looks my size. Well, I'll get, let me get warmed up a little bit. I'll crack my neck. Don't worry, I'm signing my waiver in the air right now. You got a little something to say? Oh, you're good, man. Just a few tries. Ooh. Hold up. Watch your ankles. He gets this. If he gets this, you gotta subscribe to him. <laughs> and then subscribe to me. Nah, they gotta subscribe to you, bro. Yeah. Hopefully. This one's for you, bro. That was so close. I count that. I count it too. We're gonna count. We're just gonna freeze frame it. When I land, give it a second. Guys, if you want to see more skate content, let me know and comment below. Second channel? Oh Skating? my god. Oh. I'm not good enough. That'd be embarrassing. Let's yeah. try everything. BMX, <laughs> skateboard. Just the extreme. <laughs> I mean, listen, I'm down to try everything. Let's go. Nah, we we're, we're still doing our boxing? Okay. All right, so we're doing a little boxing training. It's so funny that you guys watch me do this stuff. I suck at boxing, but you still watch. So I appreciate you for that. We're gonna try a little bit of Chris's training, see how it goes. Maybe I'll just develop some tattoos all over my body throughout this, but we'll see. <laughs> Push. Damn. Quick. This guy looks like an animal. I would never want to play you. No, come on, bro. So we're doing some boxing training, and Chris is gonna take me through a little bit of the ropes, teach me some tips. I'm Hopefully just a I'll beginner. Be I'm just gonna teach you what I've learned. Teach you what you learned so far. I had a fight already lined up. Yeah. But the opponent backed out two weeks before fight day. Gotcha. So now we're in just in the works. It's really complicated. There's a lot of things that go with it, like money and like contracts and like finding the person that would actually accept yeah. it. I have something planned for November. Set. We're gonna set something up for November. Hopefully, you know, we get somebody on board. <laughs> Let's do it, baby! So the bag is, is to, to get you to your distance because when someone's Sorry. moving around. <laughs> Yeah, it's to get you comfortable and understanding distance. So when someone's here, you know exactly where to punch. Sometimes okay. people will punch right here and they're, they're too crowded. So hitting a bag will teach you how to footwork, how to maneuver around something. Also, you can use it to focus on, on power. Just, Jesus Christ, right there. That was too much arm. <laughs> I've never done anything like this. A lot more meticulous and like small minuscule things that I would have never guessed to learn, but it's quite fun. Are you gonna be a boxer now? I am gonna box Jake Paul. Clearly, if he's a boxer, I could be a boxer. Jake, hit me up. Shut the f up and sit there. I look on fire. The Harriet collection, baby. Anyways, we're gonna go get some really, really good food. So we're gonna bring you along for the ride so you guys can get some mouth-watering uh, dripping of your mouth. Yeah. What? Yeah. She's pretty dope. Have you been here? Yeah, man, all the time. Can you say I'm a good chef? I'm a terrible chef. <laughs> I'm horrible. It might not even taste good because I'm just gonna cook it terribly. Lay the meat on me. <laughs> Tenderloin. Oh, let's go. That one's for you. Right on. 
Chef it up, bro. Chef it up, bro. Yo, dude, dip it in. Oh, no, you should probably put it on here first, right? Oh, my God. They call me Chef West. Oh, baby. You know how you're not supposed to play your food? Like, this is adults, but, like, you're allowed to play your food. Yo, this is, like, the, the best little setup ever. You know what I'm saying? It's like, yo, let's make a place where we have people come in and they cook their own food. Not literally. And, and you still the biggest tip. Finesse. You still tip. Yo. <laughs> it's genius. How does it taste? And they're going to want to do it all the time. It's so good. Oh, my God. Oh, baby, give me one. Oh, I didn't cook that one. Oh, you didn't cook it? No. I was wondering why it tasted weird. This one's good. <laughs> Yeah, you're such a nice guy, bro. <laughs> 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 so good. <laughs> cool, bro. Oh, extremely. We ate way too much to all the vegans out there. I'm sorry. My man, for real. It's been a great day. Yeah. Yeah, tomorrow's my film day, so like I said, I do gotta film some stuff. So maybe we make a thank video or a vlog. Let's see. I might, I might just beat you in every competition Let's for the. You're already doing it. Well, ladies and gentlemen, today has been an amazing day. If you enjoyed any bit of it, smiled once, maybe hit the like button, but most importantly, subscribe. We're on the road to a million. I'll catch you guys in the next one, and do not forget, stay relentless. Peace. Oh my God. I was getting it, baby. Yeah, yeah.